Hi everyone, and welcome to my channel. Today, we're going to be talking about the Hadopelagic Zone, the deepest layer of the ocean. It's so deep, in fact, that it's called the Trench Zone. It extends from 6,000 meters, 19,700 feet, to the very bottom of the ocean, which can be as deep as 11,000 meters, 36,000 feet. The pressure at the bottom of the Hadopelagic Zone is also extremely high, and it can be more than 1,000 times the pressure at sea level. This layer is home to a few deep sea fish, as well as some worms and bacteria. The creatures that live in the Hadopelagic Zone are adapted to the extreme pressure and darkness. For example, some fish have bioluminescent organs that help them attract prey. Here are some of the most interesting creatures that live in the Hadopelagic Zone. Hagfish are eel-like creatures that have a slimy, eel-like body. They have sharp teeth and a rasping tongue, and they can produce a foul-smelling slime that can deter predators. Hagfish are scavengers, and they feed on dead animals that have fallen to the bottom of the ocean. The coffinfish is a deep-sea fish that has a flattened body and large eyes. It is named for its coffin-shaped head. The viperfish is a deep-sea fish that has a long, slender body and a bioluminescent lure on its chin. It uses the lure to attract prey. Hadal snailfish are slender, eel-like fish with large heads and small eyes. They have long, thin jaws lined with sharp teeth that they use to eat small crustaceans and other animals. The amphipod is a small, shrimp-like creature that is found in the Hadopelagic Zone. Amphipods are scavengers and eat dead animals that fall from the surface of the ocean. Gulper eels are deep-sea fish with large mouths and long, narrow bodies. They have sharp teeth and can swallow prey that is much larger than themselves. Gulper eels are often found near hydrothermal vents, where they feed on small fish and crustaceans. Cusk eels are characterized by their long, slender bodies and their eel-like appearance. Cusk eels can grow up to 6 feet, 1.8 meters, long, and they have a large mouth with sharp teeth. Cusk eels are predators, and they feed on a variety of small animals, including fish, squid, and crustaceans. The Hadopelagic Zone is a mysterious and fascinating place. We are still learning about the creatures that live there, and there are sure to be many more amazing discoveries in the future. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed learning about the Hadopelagic Zone and the creatures that live there.